I'm Rebecca Robeson. Welcome to Robeson Design. I have a couple of things for you this week. First, we updated Shara's room and it looks glam-tastic. We have a new video coming out this month. It's a YouTube collaboration called New Year, New You and we'll show you everything that we did. You're getting to see these things before it actually airs and I hope it doesn't spoil it for you, but there was just one thing I could not wait to surprise Shara with. I think we need to address your bed. What's wrong with my bed? Well, there's nothing wrong with the bed. I love the headboard, but the mattress. This mattress you've had for five years, I think, mm -hmm. and it's from Ikea. I could probably use a new mattress. Okay, I'll give you that. I mean, is it very comfortable? Not really. Okay, so we've propped it up with foam over the years, mm -hmm. right? Yeah, well, I think it's about ready to sink in, in the center. <laughs> so I got you a new mattress. Seriously? Yep. Oh my gosh. And it's a Casper mattress. What? This is like the coolest, hippest company. Buy it online, they send it to you in a box, and after 100 days, if you don't like the bed, you can send it back. And hopefully I have my other mattress. And the price, honestly, is really, really good. So, oh. I got it, it's here. You wanna bring it in? I do. Let's bake your bed! Oh. Okay. Let's stop. There's so many other meters. Gosh, this thing is so comfortable. You know what? Even, even I like those phone layers we usually put on this, our bed. You know why? why? This thing is made out of memory foam. Really? Yep. Wow. And it's made in America. Made in America. Well, Mama, I'm gonna sleep good tonight. Can't you tell by the denim right here? Mm hmm Yeah. Okay, listen. What? Other than the fact that you are welcome, I think we should make your bed. You guys left such great comments and feedback on our bed making video from the Desert Rose Inn. So I was thinking, since we're doing an update for Shara's room, why not see if we can come up with a couple of more ideas that we can help you guys with in your own rooms. How about we show them how I make a bed and how you make a bed. We'll show them both. I'll show all you why jitters how to make a bed. Why jitters? <laughs> Well, you don't have to make it by yourself. Make it together, but just make it your way. She tucks. I'm impressed so far. No, wait, you should do this by yourself. As if I'm not here. Stop trying to help it. Oh, I can't help it. <laughs> yep, put the, the uh, pillowcase. Oh, I see things, and I just want to fix them. Two simple weights. The dashing duvet. That's pretty cute, the dashing part. Because we're always on the go. Exactly. I wish you actually did it this way every day. I do do it I this way. I don't think you do. What would you call mine? Because I'm going to add another five minutes to it. Mm, the deluxe duvet. Perfect. Moving on. So this is the extra comforter that I bought you. I did get Shara a new comforter and some new pillows. It's not cheating. This is the deluxe duvet. What the heck is this? This isn't even a pillow. But you got this thing so messed up. See? Get off of the bed. You're messing it up. Saboteur. And here's a, a brass color pillow. And then we're going to add a gold colored pillow. Now we're getting somewhere. This is maybe what I would do on the weekends when you're having guests over to your place. And you want it to just to look a little bit nicer. But during the week, you got your dashing duvet. On the weekends, the deluxe duvet. You like it? I like it. Good, I do too. I still think mine is much better though. You do? It's just much faster. I mean, yours looks a lot more wow. Yeah, but, but don't. I can't do this every day. I just said, do it on the weekends. Did you miss that part? Even on the weekends. You can't do it. Okay, well then I'm gonna take my fancy gold and silver pillows <laughs> no, home no, with no, me. No, 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 I like yeah. them. I like no, them. really? Because mm -hmm. when are you ever gonna use them? Um, on the weekends. <laughs> So what do you think? Does your bed look more like Shara's or Rebecca's? Rebecca's or Shara's? Or which would you rather your bed look like? How about that? Which one would you want your bed to look like? Shara's or Rebecca's? All right, so you're gonna teach me how to do a duvet. I'm excited to learn because I always have this a hard a time with this. This is a 10 second trick that I found. That's amazing. So the next thing that we have for you today is how to easily put a comforter inside of a duvet cover. So you're gonna fold the opening towards the end once, and then you're gonna fold it again towards the end twice. And we're gonna do the same thing to this. Turns out, there is no easy way to put a comforter inside of a duvet. There's no graceful way to do it, you just stuck it in there. Do it that way. 
It's so hard to put a comforter inside a duvet cover that we actually don't have that video for you. <laughs> but if you've got an idea how to do it, please leave us a comment because we'd love to make a video on it. I hope you enjoyed our bed making challenge today. Remember the new year, new you video will be out in about two weeks, so keep an eye out for that. And if you happen to be in the market for a new mattress, you must check out Casper's website. If you type in the promo box Robeson, they're actually gonna give you $50 off. You're welcome. As always, we love seeing you guys. Thanks for coming by, and we look forward to seeing you guys next Monday on Driven to Design. Bye-bye for now. I need a manicure and pedicure badly. I'm Can you tell? A I'm gonna need a minute. Yeah, your feet are a little brown. Look. Really? Okay, now let's do it right. Subscribe.